All right, what's up everyone? Uh, this is gonna be my first mouse review and I'm gonna do it on a mouse that I've been using for a while, which is the G Pro Super Lab. I've been using it for two months. And uh, I'll start off with the build quality. Uh, whenever I play Aim Labs, I'm a barbarian, right? And I squeeze it hard as shit, as hard as I can pretty much. And there's no flex, no nothing. Uh, I know you probably can't hear it, but there's no flex, no creaking or anything. I usually just squeeze on the sides. I don't squeeze anywhere else. Uh, I don't really care about mouse wobble or anything like that. It doesn't really affect me, and I don't think it affects anyone. I guess it's like a uh, deterrent to see how uh, well the build quality is, but I could care less about that. The uh, mouse wheel is very good. Uh, I think it's gotten softer over time, but I kind of use it a lot since I use it to jump in Valorant. Or I use it to switch to my pickaxe in Fortnite if I ever play that. Or but, um, yeah, I don't use the side buttons. I've never really clicked on them. Uh, if I do click them, they're on accident. But I think they're when I, when I tried them out, they were pretty good. Uh, the mouse feet, great mouse feet, I think. Uh, I didn't feel the need to replace them. Uh, I used to play with the puck here, but uh, I don't play with it anymore because I felt like there was nothing really. I was not really getting anything out of that. Um, the battery is fucking amazing. I think uh, the mouse turns off uh, if you're not using it within like five seconds of it. So the battery life is amazing. I haven't charged it in like four days. So uh, yeah, uh, I use it on a Zowie GSR. Um, it's really good. I'm more of a control player, but uh, the shape is really safe. Obviously, right? This is the everyone knows the super light. Here's my Xenix GX Air. Right now, let's do uh, let's do that. They're right next to each other. This is the S2 copy. I don't really use it because uh, I don't know why, but the wireless on mine is fucking up. It's, I think it's my motherboard but or some issue. The G Pro Super Lite doesn't really lag out. It will uh, sometimes, but all of my mice do that, so it's kind of weird. Even though I have the fucking uh, dongle right here. But, um, yeah. The, and then here's the uh, Viper Ultimate for comparison. Yeah, I have a lot of fucking mice. Um, but uh, I don't really have anything bad to say about the Super Lite, honestly. I don't really care that there's no RGB. Um, I don't care that it's micro USB because I barely have to fucking charge it. And if I do charge, I just plug it in overnight like I do with my phone. It's not that hard. But um, <clears throat> yeah, I don't really know what to say. The clicks are amazing too. Clicks are, uh, let me see. I don't know if you can hear that. But yeah, the clicks are amazing. This is the right click. This is the left click. This is the mouse wheel. These are uh, the side buttons. I have no bad things to say about this. Um, I will probably edit in a few clips of me from uh, Immortal slash Radiant gameplay and uh, my top grid shot speed score. But yeah, this uh, this mouse is amazing. But the only there's like two issues with it, which is our uh, the mouse feet. Right, there's not another pair. There's not another pair of mouse feet in here, so. You kind of have to buy core pads, which are a little faster than these. I've used I've used core pads on these. They're a little faster than these uh, mouse feet, which kind of suck, but whatever. And then um, the other issue is the price. The shit is $150. So I would only say it's worth it if you uh, are really, I don't know, a really competitive person and really into uh, being the best player you can be, you know. So if you can justify spending $150 on it, I would say get it or at least try it out. If you don't like it, you know, return it or sell it on mouse market. But um, yeah, for me, it was worth it. It may, I mean, I think it made me better. But um, yeah, I have really no, no issue with this mouse, honestly. If I was a little bitch, if I was going to be a bitch about something, it'd be, there's no USB-C, but I mean... They would probably do this, uh, whatever the fuck this shape is, to make it so it only goes in one way, anyways, like they did with the, or uh, like how Glorious did with the Model O wireless. But yeah, it charges really fast. It, uh, the battery life lasts fucking forever. And, uh, yeah, I guess that's it. I'll edit in some clips. And yeah, that's my first mouse review. Dash on the site. Nice shot. One's 410. Oh three, my three, god. All three, all three. Four ten, four ten, four ten. What the fuck? Spike right. Last one, four ten is. He's, he was playing with the element. Nice. Oh. Oh.